Let me start today's Weddings and Romance webinar. A big thank you to everybody for joining us. I'm just going to let everybody introduce themselves to start with. Um, so Tracy, hello. It's lovely to see you. That backdrop looks amazing. Where are you? Where Where is it based? That, that's actually St. Kitts. So ah. I'm not talking about St. Kitts today, but um, yeah, that's one of the hotels in St. Kitts. I'm not there, so please know, you know, it's just an illusion. <laughs> <laughs> well, you could be I'm anywhere. Really You'd be sorry. <laughs> Excellent. But welcome Excellent. everyone. I'm Craig, a central detail, and I will be talking to you a little bit more about one of our properties in Spusha and another in Jamaica. Super amazing. Thank you very much, Tracy. Um, we've also got Donovan. Donovan, hello. Do you need an introduction? I don't believe you do. I think everyone knows you. Hello, me. I'm Donovan Donaldson from the Jamaica Tourist Board. Unfortunately, at the moment, based in London, but I'm giving you a virtual um feel of what I would be doing if I was in Jamaica now which is rafting on the Rio Grande super amazing thank you very much we've also got um Anna Jo who'll be joining us very shortly um she's just having a few issues um technical wise but she's coming up oh, she's here I am Good hello morning. hello tell us who you are Anna Jo and um what you will be talking about today um, so we represent Ocean by H10 Hotels and we have two hotels, uh, well, we have hotels in different destinations, two in particularly in Jamaica, since I see some of our fellow Jamaicans there. Um, Ruben Velázquez will be joining us soon uh, with a wedding presentation today. Mm -hmm. Super, thank you very much. So without thank further ado, I'm going to hand over to Donovan that can take us to on a tour of Jamaica and tell us all about the weddings and romance. Fantastic. So uh, let me just hide this. Great, I'm all here. Y'all. So good afternoon or good morning, depending on where you are. I'm going to give you a quick overview on weddings and romance in Destination Jamaica. Great destination for proposals, weddings, anniversaries, renewals of vows, or just being romantic. So come back to loving, come back to romance and romantic experiences. The team here, so, oops. The team here uh, consists of myself. Um, I cover the Southern United Kingdom and Channel Islands. We have Torrance who covers the Ireland, Nordics and Nice and Shanika, who many of you may know North. She covers the Northern UK region, Midlands, Wales and Scotland. So I'm going to speak about first some of the main reasons to choose Jamaica for a wedding or a romantic experience. And the first thing we like to say is that you are in expert hands when you're in Jamaica. We have approximately 10,000 Brits visiting Jamaica annually for weddings and honeymoons. And that is a testimony, testimony that you are indeed in expert hands when you visit Jamaica. Another thing is that many, or in fact, all the weddings are tailored for you, the clients, when you come. A very wide range of accommodation available and most hotels would have their own weddings department, which can make the dream wedding or proposal or anniversary come true. Again, another good thing about Jamaica is that you know, it's affordable, great value for money having your weddings in Jamaica. And one thing, one joke I normally said, it's that it's a great way to have your wedding and the people you don't want to come probably won't come like some of the in-laws. So it's a great option to get to Jamaica, great value for money and fantastic experiences getting married in Jamaica. Another reason, fantastic stag and hen party options. Jamaica has everything. So the guys like to do things. My favorite is going deep sea fishing. And in fact, this time of year is perfect. We have the Marlin coming in. Uh, there is a blue Marlin tournament actually going on as we speak. But this time of year is fantastic for deep sea fishing. And of course, the ladies have several options, including foam parties. And of course, nothing beats a hen or a stag do without an ice cold red stripe beer. And of course, the last fling before the ring, Jamaica offers all the options and some of them 
I just described. Another reason to choose Jamaica for your wedding or honeymoon is location. We like to say location, location, location. Stunning vistas to have your photographs taken from the beach to the gardens by waterfalls in front of great houses at aqueducts, lots of venues and locations. And as I said earlier, the wedding department in all our hotels would be able to assist in choosing the perfect venue, whether on property or off property. And of course, unusual options. We even had a wedding take place on the rafts, rafting down the river. So they had the wedding ceremony and then the bride and groom and each couple or guests were on a raft with a picnic basket, a bottle of champagne, and they just gently was pulled down the river like you see me right here, enjoying the scenery and enjoying some drinks. And that was in fact a very unusual uh, reception. Another reason to choose Jamaica, choice. I mentioned earlier that we have a wide range of accommodation available. You can have your luxury to your affordable weddings, unique religious weddings, and of course, renewal of vows are available on island. The beach wedding, very popular for many people who are staying in resort. It gives that tropical feel and it gives a different uh, experience. But in addition to beach weddings, we also have church weddings. So people who are very religious and think they have to get married in a church, Jamaica has the most churches per square mile than any other destination in the world. And your wedding coordinator or the wedding department in any hotel can, ar can arrange a church wedding off property for you. We not only do Christian weddings, but we also do other religious weddings. Here we have an image of a Jewish wedding, which is by the Laughing Waters Waterfall, uh, not far from Duns River Falls. Again, stunning locations to have your weddings. Indian weddings or Asian weddings are also um, available to be had in Jamaica. We don't have the big elephant for the groom to ride in, but we have lots of horses which are available. And it is something that is becoming more and more popular to have other religions having their weddings in Jamaica and it because we can accommodate them. Now getting to Jamaica is very easy. We have direct service from Montego, to Montego Bay, sorry, from London Heathrow, London Gatwick, Birmingham and Manchester. And we also have direct service to Kingston from London Gatwick. So it's lots of options from the UK to get to, um, Jamaica, and of course, for the agents who are in the US or in North America, you know there are several options from many airports across North America. New from the UK for winter this year, we have North Atlantic Airways. They will commence a nonstop service from London Gatwick to Montego Bay, and they will be flying four days weekly, and that starts at the beginning of December this year. So again, another option. A lot of people ask, what is North like? It is a low cost carrier, but the seats are very generous and it should be a very good addition to what we have going to Jamaica from the UK. We introduced on the 1st of September this year, our new C5 form. It's called enterjamaica.com. It's a platform which has it. We no longer issue paper immigration cards on flights for you to fill out. As long as you fill it out before you land or before you get to the immigration desk or kiosk, it's quite easy. You just go to enterjamaica.com and there you put you complete your C5 form. It's faster data entry for us and it's done quite easily. And importantly, a lot of people have been asking about the cost. There's no cost, it is free as it was before on all the other airlines when you got the bit of paper. Now, on arrival in Jamaica, we have fantastic concierge services available. And Jamaica is so popular, I can tell you, you get to Montego Bay, you may be in the queue for quite some time because lots of flights are arriving at the same time. So Club Mobay is available. It's under the umbrella of VIP attractions. We have Club Mobay in Montego Bay, Club Kingston in Kingston. 
They have VIP meet and greet arrival services. So there'll be somebody at the end of the walkway, you get off the plane with a sign with your name, and they will fast track you through immigration, through customs, and you wait in a VIP arrival lounge. If you are staying at a resort that has their own lounge at the airport, you'll be taken to that lounge. In Kingston, similar services are available and both lounges have, are award-winning lounges. So fantastic services available. Great food, great drink, quiet areas, meeting rooms, uh, spa, shower facilities. So they are indeed very good um, services available on arrival and departure from Jamaica. Now, saying I do in Jamaica, of course, we have to mention the legal bits. The legal age for marriage in Jamaica is 18 years. If under 18 years old, you will need to have consent of a parent. Uh, witnesses are required. However, if you're traveling alone or your clients are traveling alone, the resort can easily arrange witnesses for you. Uh, you have to be resident on island for 24 hours before getting married. Uh, it has to be a weekday and very few people, you get to Jamaica, you want a couple of days to relax, enjoy, um, make sure that all the arrangements in place. But of course, the marriage license must be applied for ahead of time and your resort wedding planners or wedding department will be able to facilitate this. Again, Instagram, a lot of us live on social media. And a great thing about Jamaica is that you can have so many Instagrammable uh, images to share with friends who probably could not join you in Jamaica for their memorable wedding or uh, anniversary. Uh, and of course, begin your honeymoon in style. Why not fly off to another part of the, uh, the island? So you may have your weddings in Montego Bay and everybody's there. They've all come to Jamaica with you. But of course, you want to have your honeymoon a little way off. So you have that special time. And why not begin in style and have a helicopter pick you up and whisk you off to one of the six resort areas on island to begin a fantastic life together. Lots of experiences that provide lasting memories and spectacular photographs. Again, we mentioned Instagram, Facebook, social media. Jamaica offers so many options for you to take the most beautiful pictures while you're on your honeymoon or your wedding. Of course, we like to say, come back to loving. Jamaica is a loving destination with lots to do. Come back to romantic, rediscover yourselves. You may be going through a rough patch in your marriage. Come back to Jamaica. We are sure we can make the fire reignite while you're there. And I'd like to end by... What the world needs now is more than a vacation. We need to come back to feeling our best selves again. Back to inviting. Back to loving. Back to life. Back to the little bit of Jamaica that's inside all of us. Come back to being lively again. Back to laid back. Back to romantic. Come back to the vibe that comes alive in Jamaica. So come back to the vibe that comes alive in Jamaica. So thank you very much. And I'm available for all the questions you may have at the end of today's wow. webinar. Super, thank you very much, Donovan. Great presentation and great to see Jamaica. Um, you, we will be having a lot of questions asking for a copy of that video. So don't worry, we will send them out um, tomorrow or when Donovan does his follow-up. So thank you very much, Donovan. Enjoy your boat ride um, and we'll catch up with you very soon. Okay, then. <laughs> thank you. So I'm going to hand over now to Tracy. Tracy, take us to St. Lucia and Jamaica. Okay, perfect. Hold on a second. All right. Can you see my screen okay? Yep. 
Yep, someone give me a yes and I know that. <laughs> okay, welcome everyone. Thank you for coming along today and um, thank you, Sarah, for giving us the opportunity to present a couple of hotels from our very special portfolio. For those that don't know me, I'm Tracy and I head up the team at Essential Detail. And we're very fortunate, we actually, those that are not familiar, we actually represent 12 lovely boutique across a stunning Caribbean island. So they're all here in front of you. And today I'm going to be presenting to you East Winds in St. Lucia and the iconic Jamaica Inn in Jamaica. One thing though that all our properties actually have, so all 12 of them have a very common ethos. They are all boutique, um, they're very small, they're friendly. So they range from seven rooms to maximum 55. They have a lot of local character and on their doorstep is very much a lot of his local experiences. So they have charisma. Most of them are owner managed, which means the manager is on site and they treat their staff like family. Our staff have been with us at some hotels for 20, 30 years. Our guests become friends, which means we end up with a very high volume of reputation. And that's very, very much down to um, why we have such really great reviews on TripAdvisor. We're able to deliver individual guests um, experiences or requests. So if you have any requests, whether someone just wants yellow flowers in when they arrive, or they want Santa to rock up on a jet ski at Christmas. No, we talk to the hotels. If we can't deliver the aspect that they're wanting, we'll find something very close to it. Yet I've yet to find an elephant on the beach in the Caribbean. So I've not been able to fulfill as yet. Um, we focus very much on added value and tea. So we're not a price driven product. We are all about quality, which is great for you guys because it means a higher commission because it's a higher value value holiday that you're, you're selling. We can offer extended stays, so anyone that wants to stay longer than the 9, 14 um, nights average stay, let us know. We'll look at discounts. Obviously, being boutique, we can offer buyout rates and great for the romance market. We can offer for weddings, we can offer rollover rates, which means we can actually guarantee pricing for 2025, 2026 right now. Most of our hotels or all of them are sustainable, um, some slightly more than others, and they all have a giving back program where they give back to the island. So I'm going to start with East Winds in St. Lucia. Um, I'm going to give you a quick overview of the hotel and then I will come on to the romance because that's obviously why we're here. So East Winds is very low key, informal, it's elegant, it's private. It's a four star hotel that delivers, over delivers, but delivers a five star expense. It's set in just 12 acres of lush tropical gardens. It is beach fronted and it's almost a private beach, even though you can't have one in St. Lucia. And the reason it's almost private is you can only get to it either from the sea or coming through the property itself. The property is made of um, semi-detached intimate cottages. This is our lead-in room, um, our superior cottage, and you can see it is extremely spacious and has an outdoor area as well, outdoor patio. And then our higher end room categories are oceanfront rooms and our oceanfront suite here, which again, you can see is very spacious and they have the oversized verandas that look out right onto the and over to the ocean. For food and beverage, um, or in the evening, our guests tend to meet at the Sunset Beach Bar. Um, here we serve premium drinks, cocktails, and during the day, they serve the same kind of drinks as well. We have a light menu, and um, basically guests just come here just to meet other guests. It's a real magnet for getting people to know other people. During the evening, we offer silver service dining. Remember, we are only four star. Um, so it's of course silver service dining. We pair the food uh, with wine. We do not have house wines. We serve wines from the cellar that are paired with each meal, offering two reds, two whites, and two rosés. We have a farm to table concept. So a lot of our produce is actually grown in the grounds of the hotel. And if it isn't, it's sourced locally from the land and from the sea, as you can see with the lobster. 
We do have a pool with a swim up, and you almost would think, well, why am I telling you that? Because all hotels have pools and swim up bars. Ours is quite unique because you can actually, um, the guests go and serve themselves. So you can go to the bar, whip up some cock drinks, serve the other guests. Lucky enough to get lots of big tips, then you'll be back next year. And you couldn't afford to. So we have a goal, um, we have a lot of activities and fitness um, experiences around the property. So we have a garden spa. It really is one with nature. We don't play music. You just listen to the crickets and the birds. It's really, really relaxing. And all the produce actually from the gardens itself, as you can see here. We have a yoga and Pilates pavilion, a fitness track. There's no sort of an outdoor gym, if you like. We offer cooking classes, garden tours. Cooking classes are great to get a groom in there so then you can cook for us all when you get back, us, all us ladies. We offer non-motorized water sports, reef snor snorkeling and sail lessons. So here's our pavilion. The gardens themselves are really extensive. Um, those 12 acres, we have over 30 species of tropical birds around the gardens and over 100 species of plants and trees. So you can actually go around the garden with the head gardener. Every day we do something to do with food and drink, as you can see here, which is um, true. <laughs> um, and we have off-site off excursion tours as well that we offer. So East Winds in summary is a breathtaking tropical garden by the sea. And just a quick recap, just remember it's four star delivering a five star experience. It's elegant, it's understated, it's got premium inclusion and it offers a really wonderful experience for a bride and groom. So basically for weddings, when the bride and groom arrive, the bride is actually taken with by Glenda, um, our wedding specialist, to go and meet Savannah, who is our head gardener. And you're most probably thinking, why are we going to meet the head gardener? We will take you around the gardens and basically the bride is then able to pick her bouquet of flowers and her colour scheme for her wedding compliments from the hotel. So whatever she decides on her colour scheme from the garden, and if for any reason we haven't got the colour, we will go and find it somewhere. So our wedding packages go from intimate, from just two people, to what we call a complete buyout at 72 people. So that's the maximum that we can take at the hotel. The wedding package itself, again, is a complete gift. It is a present from the hotel to the couple, and it's gonna be everything you see, all the pictures to follow and the video. So it includes all the babies, the marriage license, um, the whole setup of the wedding, all the flowers, all the chair covers, everything you see is actually a gift from the hotel to the wedding couple, providing they spend seven nights at the property. So I'm just going to quickly check the video. <laughs> okay yes i will send the video to you anyone wants it we'll put it on a follow-up for you um just some of the beach locations just to show you we can do very small we can do the larger weddings again what you're looking at is all complement so whether it's a sunset evening reception whether it's a romantic proposal a honeymoon dinner again all of this would be complementary to the bride and groom the honeymoon couple providing they spend seven nights at East Winds in St. Lucia, one of the most romantic islands in the Caribbean. 
So as I said, we do offer honeymoon packages, anniversary packages, renewal of vows, special birthdays, all those celebrations. And just to let you know with um, regard to the wedding package, and I think one of the biggest things with weddings that I haven't actually stated yet is that we only do one wedding a week. OK, so it's very, very intimate. It's very exclusive. And if the bride and groom do actually book over 50 room nights, it's not them, but the party, we will actually provide them complimentary accommodation. So there's different discounts depending on the number of rooms they actually or the number of room nights they actually purchase. We invite them back as an anniversary package with a 50 percent discount. We encourage them to come back and book with you. They're your client, not our client. And our honeymoon package includes two complimentary spa treatments and also lovely romantic sunset cruise. So here's our wonderful team at East Winds that put all this together for you. And I can't leave East Winds without those main lovely romantic sunsets. So from St. Lucia, we're going to head across now to Jamaica and this really, truly iconic hideaway at Jamaica Inn. So Jamaica Inn was built back in the 1950s. It was the place, and I still think it is the place to actually visit. Um, it's been the same family for the last 65 years, and it's in the fourth generation of that family. So it's very, very hands-on managed. And as you can see here, we've had Winston Churchill, who is a frequent visitor doing his watercolors, Marilyn Monroe, um, her honeymoon here, Meghan Markle, dare I say, had her first wedding here. Um, so we've had lots of really romantic gatherings at Jamaica Inn. It is an elegant, intimate hideaway up on the north coast of Jamaica. It has an amazing beach, um, 7,000 feet of soft sand. I know Torrance always says it's one of the best beaches in Jamaica. It's the same beautiful cove. Just 52 accommodations um, throughout, ranging from room suites and private cottages. So the actual lead-in rooms you can see here all have an ocean view. You can always see the ocean from these oversized Every room you can see the ocean. This is the blue cottage, and we do have other one and two bedroom cottages, all with private pools and also with direct sea access. So they all have their own private sea access and plunge pools. This property offers everything on a board basis from bed and breakfast right round to an all inclusive with a dine around. We encourage our guests to go out and actually experience local, to spend money local. So we encourage them to go out and visit different areas around the island and dine around as well. In the evening, many of our guests will meet here on this elevated terrace for a romantic drink. Um, in the main restaurant, which is outside, we do ask um, men to wear trousers, full length trousers and collared shirts. However, four nights a week, we do offer casual dining at Peddy's Beach and Bar um, Grill. And you can really put your, sat, your feet in, the, your toes in the sand here. So this is much more casual on the dining front. Jamaica Inn includes a lot, even in their B&B &B pricing. So they include a rumology, which is learning about the rums and tasting, shopping with the chef and cooking, a spice and fruit and garden tour farm to skin foraging and yoga so you can learn about what the produce around the garden actually do and help your skin wellness. We have croquet and rosé, just a little tip here, don't take these guys on and place a bet, I'm sure they're professionals, they win every single time I'm out there. One of my favourites is Bond on the Beach, every Thursday evening we put up a screen, a projector, and we serve martinis and popcorn while you just sit there watching the iconic Bond film that's on, on that particular week. And no hotel in Jamaica really is not right without something to do with James. So why Jamaica Inn? As I said, a quick recap, it's intimate, it's elegant, it really is a hideaway. Lots of famous past guests, and I'm sure there's going to be lots of famous new guests at uh, some point. We have those lovely um, oversized verandas for private dining inside or outside. You can dine that lovely beach. And we also have amazing 
um, venues for weddings. We can really make more than a dream come true at Jamaica Inn. This is the reception when you check in. It's absolutely stunning, really romantic. This is one of our most probably popular spots for wedding. It is the elevated west wing side, and it is elevated above the sea with lovely breezes. And again, this can be set up for just two people, or you can set up for over 100, just over 100 people. Our beach setting, and then we have what we call our lawn to sea. So you can be on the lawn and then have your party down on the sea. Really, the whole property is up to you where you would like to dine. And the same for special birthdays, anniversaries, renewal of vows, proposals. We can have a really intimate setup for you on the beach. Or you may prefer just to have private dining on those oversized verandas. The chef will actually, or the, the waiter will come with each course. They don't just bring a tray along and just give you all the courses. Everything individually served as it's cooked, even in the privacy of your own room. So the weddings themselves, as I said, this is really iconic, this hotel. It really has a wealth of history everywhere that, you know, your guests aren't going to argue. They're all going to have a sea view. They can take whichever dining option they want. It really is romance under the sun. And even more, if you get married between June and November, you may have some special guests actually turn up at your wedding. Fortunately, you won't have to feed them. So between June and November, we have up to 16,000 baby turtles hatch on our beaches at Jamaica Inn, and it's part of our um, conservation program. We have a um, turkey conservation program and a coral conservation uh, program as well. So our wedding packages, I'm not expecting you to read that. We'll send you some details, don't worry. This is our wonderful team that really make it happen. And we come step further. You may want someone special to bear those rings to come to the bride and groom. And I'm sure Shadow will accommodate that request for you. So that's it from the Maker Inn and East Winds. Um, all our resources, if you've missed anything, are available on our website. Please don't hesitate to download anything. We are out on the road in the UK. If you want to fly us over to the US, more than happy, or anywhere else in the world, we're happy to come and uh, accommodate. Um, if you are doing any of your own consumer shows, let us know. We'll have support show offers steal any of our content on social media for your own social media if you need something extra booking online especially if you're up against an, a big airline operator let us know if you don't ask you don't get if we can give you some added value to support we will do we offer incentives, we offer educationals with our tourist board partners, and we also offer trade rates for you. These are some of the operators in the UK that we work with. And all I can say from there is thank you so much for listening and your time. And if you need any further information, please don't hesitate to contact myself, Megan, or one of the team. Thanks ever so much. Thank you very much, Tracy. Lovely to see how trade friendly you are. So that was just phenomenal. So thank you very much. Loving it. Loving the two hotels. So I'm going to pass over now to Anna Jo and her colleague. Anna, are you there? Yeah, I can take it. I'm ready. Hello. Thank you. <laughs> just remind me your name because I've um, we've got you down as Anna at the moment. Don't worry. It's Ruben. Ruben Velasquez. Ruben, hello. Welcome. Thank you. Let, let me take over this. Uh, Have I spelled your name correctly? R U B E N? Correct. Ah, super amazing. So let me see if you can see the screen. Can't see anything at the moment. Did you press share screen? And Ruben, if you've got a video, tick your box to share your sound. Here we go. Awesome. I was trying to show in my face, but um, my internet connection is a little slow, so I will take it off later. But I want to say hello, everybody. So I'm um, so happy to be here. 
um, I remember last kiss, your pocket size PDN, and of course your destination wedding specialist. Uh, my email, I always like to introduce myself before going any further. Um, when we think about destination weddings, everybody thinks about the beautiful couple, they desire, what do they want to do, the big party, the beautiful dress. But at some point, you have to think about the beautiful spot that you want to have pictures, you know, the spaces for every member of the wedding group, not only the bride and groom, but finding these American amazing spots to take pictures, even the ones that you don't even have in mind that you need it. So that is the kind of wedding that our couples are doing these days. Those are, you know, people that they want to post pictures on Instagram, they want to share with their families, they want to leave the experience with the father of the bride, the mother, those beautiful moments that you have to consider. And every detail matters. The devil is on the details. You have your friends, you have your best friends, you have that little um, bridemaid that will get drunk and start hitting in cute guys, you know, when they're at the wedding. So in Ocean, we focus not only in the wedding, uh, in, the, in the wedding couple, but every member of the wedding group matters. So I will let you know about our wedding experiences, but starting from the company, I just wanted to point out that we belong to a larger family, which is age 10. We have over 65 hotels in Europe, and the, the hotels that we represent, it's like a beautiful dream. I will say it's like a thick house or palazzo that has been turned into a beautiful modern hotel. In the ocean, in the Caribbean, we don't have palazzos where we have creating them. And we have the ocean. That's why it's ocean by age 10. We have hotels in Mexico, Dominican Republic, and every, and of course, Jamaica. And um, every hotel has a different personality, has an accent that will let you know that you are living at the destination. You have, it has certain personality that is going to make everybody feel like, hey, I am Jamaica. I feel free. I feel feel like I'm floating. So that is the kind of vibe that we offer in all of our hotels. The entry level would be a junior suite ocean um, room. So that means that we have enough space, say GL for families that they want to travel and they want to enjoy. And we even when we have a big property, we have different sections. These represent actually um, the best layout that we can and have it's in one corner in the right corner you have el beso which means a kiss that area it's an adults only area and then we have the daisy section on the left that is the family idea ideal for couples with kids that's what we call it it's kind of boring to let them know that they are family they are couples with kids and then we have another category that we call privilege so that is perfect for the ones that are looking that experience of open the window see the ocean is the perfect location for your clients that are looking for a romantic getaway or perhaps a honeymoon so since we are multi generational with a family section and of course an adult section at the same time is the perfect spot for destination wedding you may happy every member of the wedding group they can decide to stay in the family section where all the kids are welcome you don't need to pay any extra so they have extra activities. They are welcome here from the ages of four up to 12. And we have different activities during day. And of course we have a team club as well. So they can have their own air conditioning area, video games, entertainment, board games. And for the adults, we have a school. Of course, we have a playground as well, which is El Beso. Um, this is um, featured at Ocean El Faro in the Dominican Republic, in Ocean Coral and Turquesa, and Ocean Riviera Paradise in Mexico. In Jamaica, I will let you know, it's a little different story. So here we have Ocean El Beso, which is um, actually the they have their own private area for checking in and they have activities at the pools like the DJ party, phone party, entertaining at night and day. 
And for the ones that are privileged, what actually means to be privileged? When you are checking in, of course, you have a private area, you have butler service, you have personalized concierge, you have a special wristband that will represent you everywhere you go. You can ask top shelf drinks, you have exclusive uh, Wi-Fi, you have access to a privileged lounge. So when you're working with people that have mobility issues, for example, I will always recommend the privileged room category, they will have more, um, they will feel more pampered and taken care. They will have a beautiful view. And of course, they don't have to move around all the property. They can go to the privileged lounge for breakfast, lunch, dinner in a more good med experience. And they can call popular service. They can take, take them to the spa, whatever they need to move. So I love that uh, experience of the privilege. And generally speaking, I was telling you about the story of every member of the wedding group said, yes, we, we can talk about our gastronomic offer, starting with the one I really love, the Route 66, because it starts from 6 p.m. until 6 a.m. Um, that is the, the spot that every member of the wedding group would end up asking for more drinks, having fun, having a beautiful talk. They, they're going to enjoy after that that after hours when they're looking for more party. The Mike's Coffee Shop is, of course, when you go to Jamaica, when you go to Mexico, you go to the Dominican Republic, you need a great cup of coffee. And you're gonna love that area. It not only offer coffee, but also teas, tisanas. We have beautiful pastry, sweet treats, and even panini. So you can find a perfect spot to have that beautiful, cute snack during the day. And then the Blue Moon dining experience. What is the Blue Moon? Remember that we have a family-oriented hotel, but there is a restaurant that is exclusive for adults, which is the Blue Moon. It's the perfect spot so you can connect with your significant other, have a romantic evening, forget about your problems, forget about the kids, and have a beautiful romantic evening. And that also can be a venue for, um, Actually, for the, the, the guests that are staying at El Beso, that is a, the spot to have breakfast. So you have a restaurant to have your breakfast with no eats in the area as well. Uh, for In general, in all of our properties, you will always find an Italian restaurant, a local cuisine, a local cuisine restaurant as well. You will find a um, buffet with different stations um, in all of our hotels as well. We're introducing one restaurant, which is I, uh, South Asian or Indian cuisine restaurant, which the name is Thai, that is in Jamaica. We also have the Sakura, which is the Tepanyaki. The Sakura is the most popular. It's an interactive show. It's very fun to be there. And it's the one that takes reservations for all of our guests. Um, we will always feature this kind of Caribbean street. So it's go it's pretty much like going to, you know, downtown area and that area comes alive with music and entertainment and happening. And it's surrounded by all the specialty restaurants. You can go wherever you want to go. You don't need to make reservations. Easy as that. As I said before, every section of different hotels in across uh, all of our properties has their own pool areas, their own restaurants, their own swim up bars. So they have, it feels like a hotel within a hotel, talking about Del Veso as well. We are located in Mexico, in the Rio Maya, in, the, in Jamaica, in Coral Spring area, uh, that is in Trelawney. And we are located also in Punta Cana. So that means that for you as a travel agent, we'll give you the opportunity to sell activities outside. We are well located, so it's very easy to have access to all of our properties. And you can sell more experience for the entire wedding group. Make them feel the experience of being in the destination that they are staying at, and they will enjoy outside of the property, but also inside like non-motorized aquatic sports. We have beautiful activities inside of the property every day and night as well. Um, we have a spa service inside of the property. And for the ones that are looking for, you know, be fitness all the time, we also feature um, a gymnasium and a dance club. So that is a beautiful spot that you can offer for your wedding group. So they will have another experience after the wedding is over. They can go and enjoy as well the night, the rest of the night in the dancing. 
The bowling alley is another activity that you can offer as part of the activities of the wedding group. This is featured in all of our family oriented hotels. So that means that you can have a bridesmaids versus groomsmen tournament and they will have a blast. I don't know, maybe the loser can pay for the wedding or something like that. We have the Lazy River Water Park that is featured at Ocean of Faro in the Dominican Republic and Ocean Coral Spray in Jamaica. That is another activity that you can offer as part of the wedding group. They don't need to pay any extra. They can have different activities during the week. Though we are also introducing a dining show in Jamaica. This is at Ocean Coral Spring and Ocean Eden Bay. They will enjoy this Caribbean magic show. And also they will enjoy a beautiful taste of what Jamaica can offer gastronomically. So even for the groom, nobody thinks about the groom. They can find a great spot at the sports bar, have a game, have some drinks, gather with the rest of their his friends before the wedding. So that will be another spot that they can be hanging out with their friends. And last but not least, I just wanted to show you some pictures of the Route 66, the Mike's Coffee, the Teppanyaki, the Italian, the Pez Bella. This is also a very popular venue. This is in Ocean Riviera Paradise. Uh, it's a private venue at night. It could be adapted as a private venue. We also feature a local cuisine Mexican restaurant, the Tally restaurant I was telling you about in Jamaica. I love that restaurant. We have a steakhouse. Even when we have buffet style of um, uh, restaurants, they have they are separated in different sections, so they can use a semi-private area of different areas for a welcome dinner, something like that, something very casual. The fresco bar, the, if you're a vegetarian, you're gonna love that experience of people doing the smoothies in front of you with fresh fruits of the season. And of course, my favorite room, and when we're talking about a romantic experience, I will always recommend a privileged master suite rooftop. We have different room categories, but these would be my favorite for when you're enjoying a romantic getaway or a honeymoon or even a destination wedding. It, it is separated into sections, the living room, the master bedroom, and the living room has a staircase that will take you to your own rooftop with your beautiful jacuzzi outside. It's a great experience. And of course, we feature this, this um, room category in any in other hotel. This is in Mexico, Ocean Riviera Paradise. So next time that you are planning a destination wedding, don't ask yourself. It is an adults only or a kids friendly destination weddings. You can have the best of the worst next time with Ocean by age 10. Keep in, keep in mind that what can we offer as a brand for travel agents? For you, we offer uh, commissionable wedding packages. That is amazing for you guys. So you can offer just for your, for your clients, you get extra money. This is easy as three step, one, two, three. The first step is the wedding date confirmation. So you reach out to us, let us know the date that you're interested and we let you know that it's available. All we need is just a deposit, a contract and a, full, um, and a deposit payment. Then we have the celebration itself. So when they are at the property, um, you will receive a package breakdown. Um, so we, you can send us an invoice for your commission and we can bill it for you. We can pay it. So after the wedding has been celebrated, you send us the invoice and you get your payment within 30 days. It is easy as that. But what about the wedding couple? What are they getting out of this? So. As again, we have three important steps. The wedding date confirmation remains the same. They will contact first our wedding manager. They will let them know the contracts. They will let them know the best option of the wedding, um, the venues, etc. Then we're gonna start the planning process. So this is three or four months before the wedding. Um, she will introduce to the wedding couple just to make sure that all the menus, the flowers, the decoration, the colors, the DJ, everything gets in set before time. And then, of course, the celebration itself. When they arrive at the property, they're going to be greeted by our wedding coordinator on site. And of course, she will be um, along with them all the time to let them know what to do, where to go, who to call, you know, all those questions that bride and grooms might have during their big day. 
um, we have six different options, but I just wanted to talk, I just wanted to point out a few options. The first one um, that I want you to keep in mind, it's something that we call carefree wedding package. It is very simple. You have the ceremony, you have a toast, and then you have a semi-private dinner reception at one of our restaurants. This is uh, $750 and it can be complimentary when you book five privileged rooms for five nights. So that's very easy for you. You have the confidence of selling a great um, room category that will give them everybody happy. And of course, for the wedding, they, they will think that uh, they can spend this money in a different activity, maybe going on a catamaran, maybe going on an excursion, maybe, uh, I don't know, if they want to spend that money in activities or, you know, experiences for themselves and the entire um, wedding group. It's ideal for those that are looking for something very intimate and then they are very budget oriented. The next category would be, I'm sorry, <laughs> I'll be back in a moment. I think he's just having a little uh, cough. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, I'm back. Are you, um, are you okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Back to this. Um, the next category would be ideal for up to 30 guests and includes beautiful, it, it, it is a more upgraded um, bouquet flowers. You have the ceremony service, um, open bar with local beers and local uh, and national open bar with um, different brands of where, of course. And what I really like about this is forget about the buffets. When you have a, a destination wedding that will last for three hours on the dinner reception, you want to take advantage of that. So when you are offering this, we are offering plated uh, service when, when they have at the, at the dinner reception. So people don't be walking around the wedding for two hours at the buffet. Uh, and at the end of the day, you have just one hour to enjoy and have dancing and enjoy with the rest of the group. So with this, um, it feels more elegant and sophisticated. The dinner is being presented. You have the toes, you have the first dance, you have a lot of more time to enjoy with the rest of the group. And from this experience, that is commissionable and we offer private venue so it's not a semi-private venue they have a private dinner reception so it feels more sophisticated for me and for the price that they are uh, what we are offering trust me they're going to feel they're getting more for their money includes the way the cocktail hour with um and it's a violinist player and a basic house system during the, the during that time the next option that I want to talk about, it's something that, that I call um, ideal for big families. With this option, it's up to 40 guests and you can add 10 additional guests. Again, includes the hair and makeup, the present service of the wedding gown, includes decoration for the ceremony, includes the cocktail hour with appetizers, an open bar, a violinist player, includes the flower arrangements and the personal flowers as well, includes the a view cake, and it even includes a DJ service. So um, when you're thinking about all the inclusions, but for the price that you're, we are offering, they will feel, like, hey, I don't have to worry about anyone else, anything else i call it an all-inclusive wedding experience so when you have those clients that from, from the day one they want to know hey how much do i have to pay for your wedding for my wedding which is pretty much every day this is a great option for those that are budget oriented they want to know the number up front they will they will give them a picture and a peace of mind of course uh, to let them know what, has, what, what is all included and what um, they have to pay. So they will give them a lot of air for your clients that are budget oriented. And the next experience is um, my favorite. Uh, so this goes for up to 50 guests, but it can grow as much as the wedding venue allows. So if let's say it's at the beach, um, the maximum capacity is 150. That is how much big that package can grow with an additional cost per person. 
the entire value is nine hundred nine thousand five hundred dollars, and again includes the hair and makeup, the present service, the cocktail hour, and the the DJ service with the lighting to create that atmosphere and it's of course commissionable for you includes some menu tasting so if they arrive before the ceremony before the dinner the, the reception itself um, they can enjoy um, three days in advance before going any further the DJ and lights so this is pretty much the experience they will receive a bottle of champagne at the room the bride and the groom they can have these beautiful pictures of the entire wedding uh, group with their other friends when they are getting ready so think about the experience couples nowadays are looking for experience that includes every member of the family every member of their friends so we offer that experience and they will give them a peace of mind knowing from day one how much they have to pay we have terraces with a beautiful ocean view we have gazebos that are located in gardens in front of the beach we have beach areas as well with beautiful gazebos and a beautiful romantic this is in jamaica i really love that um uh, gazebo in front of the of the beach that is beautiful and ideal for a romantic ceremony and of course i told you before about my favorite room the privilege master suite that image that is a selling image. When you sell that experience to your client, they will picture themselves having beautiful romantic experience in the jacuzzi outside. So um, just to let you know, our H10 app, uh, this is a great option that you can offer to your clients. They can download it on their phones and they will have information like the activities, program, what are they going to do, where are they going to go, the schedules, the restaurants, the menu. Um, if they want to know, I don't know, I am vegetarian, I want to know what options I will find, they will know up front the, before the arrival. And for you, of course, our beautiful rewards program, which is right now what we're talking about, my book and rewards. Um, they will give them the option to earn extra cash for every booking, no matter what channel. That will give you another tool to get extra income. So uh, thank you again. My name is Ruben Velasquez. Thank you for doing this and I'm going back with you. Thank you very much, Ruben. Great presentation. It's so good to see all the little key aspects that we would not think about. Um, so hopefully now everybody's able to really sort of confidently sell the weddings uh, packages so thank you very much to everybody today for those um, I know Donovan's been busy behind the scenes answering lots and lots of questions um, so we, there's just one point here that I've just got Jewel and um, she's booked or he has booked her H10 in Barcelona just to be mindful this is the ocean by H10 so the rewards are for the Ocean by H10 Hotel. So it's mostly it's the Caribbean, Jamaica, Dominican. Um, where else, Ruben? In Mexico. Mexico, Mexico. I forget about yeah, Mexico. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How can I do when that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The rewards so, program works for all of our Ocean by H10 at the moment. Okay, no, super. That's great. Thank you very, very much. So we've got, we've had a complete mix as well in terms of hotels and experiences. So hopefully you can find something that's perfect for each one of your clients. Um, okay, so Ruben, you need to think of a question for the agents, but you, you've got time because I'm going to let Tracy and Donovan go first. So think of something you've covered during your presentation and we're going to ask everybody um, in a moment. So if everybody can go to chat and make sure your drop down says everyone, we're just going to make sure um, that everybody's entered anyway into the prize draw. If you answer this question correctly, fastest finger first, you get 10 entries. And then tomorrow I will let you know who your winners, who the winners are. So if um, Tracy, would you like to go first? OK, you can hear me OK? Yeah, I'm on. all good. <laughs> Right, I'm going to ask you a question. As, as we've got quite a lot of Jamaica on here, I'm going to ask you a question on East Winds in St. Lucia. So how many weddings does East Winds in St. Lucia do a month? <laughs> oh, wow. I like, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm talking a four a month. I think someone's <laughs> been quite, someone has been quite clever there with uh, <laughs> putting four or five. <laughs> I'm loving it. So, so the correct answer is four. <laughs> so, yeah. So 
Rebecca was the first Thank person. You. I'm sorry, let me know. Yeah, Rebecca said four. Um, she was the uh, fastest finger with the correct answer. And then obviously it could have been four or five, depending on if we have a five week, a five week month. So are you happy yeah. to give it to Rebecca who said four? I will, yeah. but Laura, if you contact me, I will also give you a voucher um, for the hotel for um, a guest to have a spa treatment when they're down there on your next booking. Oh, that's very good. Thank you. So, Donovan. Okay, my question is, what is the name of the form that you have to digitally enter to enter Jamaica? Okay. So, the fastest finger first was Uri um, with C5. Is that the correct answer? That is the correct answer. The C5 form. And to complete it, you go to enterjamaica.com. Super amazing. Thank you very much. Lots of correct answers there. And Ruben, have you had time to think of a question? Of course. So Excellent. I said we are in three different destinations, Mexico, in the Rio Maya, and in the Dominican Republic. And I said also Jamaica. Can anyone can say uh, where are in Jamaica? We have two properties there. Ocean Cuddle Spring and Ocean Eden Bay. I would go Trulani. That is a correct answer. Tasha Latouche. There. Oh, I love you, Tasha. <laughs> Trulani is the right answer. Super. Is that okay if it's spelt wrong? <laughs> <laughs> they can have to, you know, type it very fast. I, I get it. It happens to me too. <laughs> Super. So we've got Uri, Rebecca and Tasha that have got the 10 points. So I will let you know tomorrow who the winners are. Um, a big, massive thank you to Tracy, Donovan and Ruben for coming on today and telling us all about the wedding and romance offerings at the hotels. We will do a follow up. We will send the copy of the recording. If you do have any questions, please do not hesitate to reach out to them. Um, Ruben, I'll put Anna, Joe as the, as the contact. And then if anything needs filtering through to you. Um, yes, of course. We'll, we'll send them um so thank you thank you thank you you're all amazing we love you um and thank you for your support it's it means a lot to the agents um and have a great weekend everybody hope the weather improves for those of you in the uk um and we will see you all next week thank you take care bye-bye thanks everybody bye